Tonight, we're asking questions about what was in this massive orange plume. It spewed from the Suncor refinery in Commerce City around noon today, and it has since cleared. But concerns for those of you living in the area. Denver 7's Molly Hendrickson joins us live now. Molly, what have you found out about this? Well, insiders tell us this is a strictly regulated industry. The refinery likely has sensors and other tests they can do to help determine what went into the air. But getting to the bottom of this will definitely take some time. Couldn't even see the sun. Ten hours after this massive orange plume grew from the Suncor refinery, a whole bunch of smoke just kind of came out of nowhere. The air has cleared, but the questions have not. We do not feel any toxic chemicals were released. Neither the state nor Suncor have said what was in that orange plume or how far it may have traveled. What we do know is that the directions of the winds for this afternoon were mostly coming out of the southwest, so that would blow anything in the atmosphere off to the northeast, putting it right over Commerce. City, which is where officials were looking for problems as the smoke was coming out of this area. Petroleum engineer Robert Schaff says it's likely too soon to know whether toxic chemicals were released and the final investigation will take some time. They ought to be very extremely cautious about, uh, you know, what they're telling people and what, in say, saying that it's not that it's safe would be a kind of irresponsible. Um, if they really can't tell you exactly what it is. It's not the first problem for Suncor. In January of 2012, benzene was discovered in the refiner's drinking water, prompting employees to go in for exposure testing. Three months later, the company was fined more than $2 million for violating emission standards for benzene waste. A month later, there was a problem with its processing unit and clay dust shot into the air. And as recently as April, the plant was evacuated due to a water stream leak. In Commerce City, Molly Hendrickson, Denver 7.